Today on the channel, we head to space, the final frontier with Turtle Tuesday, Raphael, Space Cadet. The spirit of Ultimate Warrior will run forever! Welcome back to the channel for another Super 7 Ultimate Edition unboxing and review. And today on the channel, from the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, we got Space Cadet Raphael. But for all your Super 7 needs and a whole lot more, make sure you're hitting up Entertainment Earth. Use discount code KYLE. Save yourself 10% all in-stock items. Anything over $79 does ship free. Got to get a deal out there. And of course, we're going to do this unboxing like we do all the other unboxings on the channel. We're going to take a look at the packaging. We're going to talk about it. We're going to unbox it. We're going to talk about it. We're going to see where it goes from there. So without further ado, let's see what's going on with Space Cadet Raphael. A very cool one from way back in the Playmates days. Now here we are in 2023. What is time with an ultimate edition of this one? And no shipper box with these turtles now. Just straight out of the package like this. Plastic wrapping. Very familiar packaging design right here with the turtle logo in the middle. Kind of a sewer manhole cover. All in green looking good. Nothing on the sides. Classic turtle logo on the back that we all know and we love. And we love. There you go. See you later. Goodbye. And then there it is. Big window box there. Space Cadet Raphael looking good. All kinds of weapons, accessories, you name it. Space Cadet, turtles, usual green brick kind of packaging design that we're used to. Classic turtles logo on the top. Nothing on the sides. And then on the back, that's where the magic happens. Got a little bit of a blurb back there. Let's see what it says about Space Cadet. Raphael, the zero gravity good guy, as he's known. Boldly going where no turtle has gone before, Raph's ready to take the foot to the final frontier. Equipped with his specially designed sewer space suit, Raph's prepared for those pressureless moments, like when he has to blast old Krang in Dimension X. Raph's suit saturated with all kinds of clever contraptions, from a two-way long-range radio to dual retro reptile rockets. Armed with his satellite slice and space sword and lucky laser Luger, Raph's ready to blast off and knock the Foot Clan clean out of orbit. How about that? Turtles in space, what will they think of next? Let's get him out of the package, see what's going on. Usual background packaging. See you later. Goodbye, all right. Get a little of this action there. Look at that, a little hose action. And then, of course, a little plastic prison across the board. Look at that. All kinds of stuff. Love how the hands were hidden at the bottom of the package. You couldn't see them there. Very clever design, I think, on that one. But there, there it is. Going to take this offline, get all this out of the package. We'll be back talking all things Space Cadet Raph. All right, we got Space Cadet Raph out of the package here. Let's break it down. Let's start with the accessories, as we usually do here. We're going to start off with the hands. There it is, the hands. Now he's got big old splayed out three-fingered hands over here. Very Raphael of him. Very Raphael. But we get extra hands here. You got two Fist of Fury space punches. They come at you in slow motion. But he does got them if you need to do them for whatever reason. We have some space fists right there. We got two standard gripping hands side to side action on these as well. All these hands got that nice space glove going on. We're here for that. And then we do got two uh, outstretched finger hand, I guess we'll call it here. Great for his space size, as we know. But looking good, once again, on brand for Raphael in his spacesuit costume. We also get some space pizza. Man, I'm here for this all day long. Looks like it's pepperoni pizza as I throw it around. I like that it's got the zipper here. It's like in a pouch or whatever. Just very cool, very space-like. Everybody loves space food. Of course, astronaut food, that freeze-dried stuff. When you're a kid, you're like, this is the greatest stuff I've ever had. And you got some space pizza right here. Very on brand for the Ninja Turtles, of course. Now he does got a little alien friend. I'm not sure if this guy ever actually had a name of any kind, but a green little tentacle-like monster, a little octopus-like fins down there. Fins on an octopus? Sure, why not? Uh, but he's got a very cool sculpt to him. Very uh, cubert like Remember that video game? That's kind of what it reminds me of a little bit in the head department. Of course, all green, yellow eyes. Means only one thing. Oakland A's fan right here. Out in space, even Oakland A's fans. 
You got two plus signs for eyes. You got a little bit of a beat going on or a bill like a duck. Uh, you do got mo or, uh, articulation on his head, which is interesting. Just a little side-to-side -side action. But he's not just a static guy. You can't move him around if you need to. So very cool little fun piece there. Now we get into some of this other stuff here. We do got two size, of course. Very iconic for Raphael. You know him from his size. Got two very lightsaber-esque is what they remind me of. They got kind of that glow, like he turned it on and bam, there it is. Kind of feels that way. You even got the hilt down here at the bottom. Very, very cool nod to Star Wars, at least in my opinion right here. But two size, got to have those for Raphael, no doubt about it. Then you got a big old uh, space sword, I guess. I don't know, a very mechanical-like sword. Handle has that same kind of red translucent plastic going on it. All kind of a nice silvery color at the top. An interesting weapon. Not going to be for me. Got to put it with the size, there's no doubt about it. But we do got that in case you want that. And then we do get a blaster, of course. You're in space. You got to be pew pew in everybody throughout space. You got a space blaster right here. Do you got a hose that plugs in the back here? Looking very good. All in silver across the board. Nice bendy hose as well. It's got some movement to it. And this plugs into Raphael, I would imagine here. Looking around, it looks like right here on the chest. Uh, off to the side of the chest, I should say. Come on, yep. Plugs right in there. And then, of course, you hold it in his hand. And you've got space uh, raft with this hose. So you do got that if you want to put that on him as well. So some decent accessories with this one. Really building out a little space force with all of his weapons, things like that. But now we get down to the main event. We get down to the actual figure. And we're going to start at the head. Big glass, I guess plastic technically, but big dome. And I love that you look and you see Raphael behind there. It's got a very good look to that dome. Very, very clear plastic. Very nice plastic on this one. Looks very, very cool. I'm here for that. Pops off very easily. I'm here for that even more. Sometimes you have to move those things, move them around to get them off. This pulls and takes out very easily. Behind that, you get Raphael. All in his space goodness. Got that space kind of hood over the top. You got the red bandana across there. White eyes. Teeth showing green skin. It's Raphael all day long. Looks really, really good. And a lot of movement on that head right there. Of course, head's going to be removable on this one. And you do get a very Stormtrooper-esque helmet here, of course, for this one. So you can plug that on there if you want to. You can almost have this as an army builder or a different character if you wanted to. Or have four of these and pretend they're all four turtles. Uh, you could do that as well. They're all under these hoods. you got a space turtle force if you want to. But looking really good. If these ever go to clearance for like 20 bucks, I wouldn't be opposed to buying three more of these and having four space turtles all together. That might be kind of cool. Uh, but it does look good. You got this extra. You got the visor. I got the yellow hoses, the black around the neck. Just looking good as an extra head goes. But I think I'm going to have to use this head and the bubble over the top. I think that's going to be the way to go for me. But it does look good. You do got a little mask action right here. So you can put this over him if you want to. Yep, it's just a little visor kind of thing that slips over the head. Got a little antenna there. He could talk to everybody if you want to. Not going to use this either, but it is another added piece here for this one in the head department uh but looking good no issues in the head and i like the options that we get with this turtle right here articulation we talked about the head of course but the arms do go around very very tight arms on this one but they will go around for us bicep cut single jointed elbows side to side elbows hands removable back force side to side no waist articulation as i knock that hand out uh, no waist articulation on this one at all. You do get a little bit of space splits. A little space splits right there. You do get single jointed knees side to side, of course. Then you get the ankles side to side. A little up and down action. Does he fit on a ringside collectible stand? Use discount code Kyle. Save yourself 10% of ringside collectibles. You guys know how that goes. Bam, there it is. He fits perfectly on that stand. If you need a little extra support for him, you can definitely do that. No problems there. Now, this whole spacesuit looking really nice. First thing you notice on the chest, you got the little R right here, which I guess defeats the purpose if you're going to build out a team. They all have R on it, but we do got that. You got the fuel tank going on. It says ooze, so it's got an ooze meter on there looking nice. Uh, just a couple extra graphics there. There's a spot to the side that connects that hose we talked about already. Got a little black piping there around the shoulders. Got the red Raphael elbow pads and knee pads on here. You got a little kind of... Uh, I guess shin guards like Terry Steinbach in space, I guess is what we'll call these. We got shin guards going on really good on him. And then you got the color. It's kind of a whitish, bluish hue color to it. 
on the entire spacesuit. That looks really nice. And it's something I just noticed here on the forearm. You got a little compact here, a little computer readout that does pull open. So you can move that open if you want to. Uh, it's got a little fugitoid in here in the yellow screen. I like that little readout. That's a nice little Easter egg for this one, I do think. Got some yellow buttons up on the arms as well. Little silver accents on the arms all over the place. Yellow down to the legs. You got pockets sculpted in there. And you've got the turtle shell on the back. That looks really, really cool. Then you got kind of a jet pack, space pack, whatever you want to call it. Some brown hoses going down the bottom. Very, very on brand for a space. Raphael and man I'm here for this one at the end of the day it's just a fun variant of the turtles once again just like the playmates like anything else not for everybody on this one there's a lot of people that want the core turtle characters like the regular version of Raphael right here you don't need all these extra different ones here but if you're into the turtles you love your super 7 ultimates you want something fun and different this might be for you at the end of the day. But what say you guys at the end of the day? You picking up this space, Raphael? You playing the long game? You passing? You not sure? Let me know your thoughts in the comments down below. And of course, you know all about this channel by now. Don't forget to like the video. Don't forget to subscribe to this YouTube channel and the other YouTube channel. Two channels going on right now. Make sure you do subscribe. And then of course, don't forget about Patreon for early access to both channels' videos, bonus content, exclusive content, you name it. All going on over there, the old Patreon channel. And Patreon, always the best way to support this very YouTube channel and all the content it does bring. You can also support the channel over there at ProSNTs.com. Search Kyle Peterson. And don't forget social media, Sir Paul 64 on the X, the underscore Kyle underscore Peterson on threads and on Instagram. So for Space Raph, I'm Spaceman Kyle. See you guys all real soon.